I'm going to show you how to create buttons in Flash. At this point, we have a motion tween that goes to the end of the screen and stops. But what we'd like to do is create a stop button that will actually stop it. So before I show you the actions, this video is just going to go over how to create a button. All right, so to create a button, I don't need to actually draw on the screen yet. What I'm going to do is I'm going to go to um, Insert, New Symbol, and I'm going to select button. I can enter a name if I'd like to, but I need to make sure button is selected. There's also options for movie clip and graphic, but I'm going to select button. Now, when I do this, all of a sudden, my screen is gone. My timeline now says up, over, down, hit, and there is a blank screen. So what I'm actually going to do here is I'm going to draw a button. I can draw it however I want to. Um, for this example, I'm simply just going to use a square. I'll just use a black square and I'm actually going to delete the middle, put some text, and I'll call this stop so that we know that it's a stop button. All right, so this is the up state of the button. You can see down below there's up, over, down, hit. Up is what the button looks like normally. If I right click and select insert keyframe on over, this is what happens when I scroll the mouse over my button. So if I want something to happen, for instance, I want the square to change color when I roll over the button, I've just done that. Down is what happens when I actually press down on my mouse. I usually don't do anything for that, so I'm just going to keep that blank. But I am going to go to hit. Hit is the hit box. I'm going to insert keyframe, and all you do for hit is I simply take a square. So this is where um, basically what uh, the hit area is of my mouse. I'm simply just going to trace my whole entire image here with hit. Um, that's all you do need to do for hit just to make sure, and I actually will do it just a little outside of my box. Um, I'll make it just a slightly bigger so my hit area is a little bigger. That's all you need to do for hit. Then I'm simply going to go to my scene, and now to place my button, the first thing I want to do is I need to create a new layer, and I want my button to be on every single keyframe, so I don't need to do anything here. I'm going to go to my library. If your library is not visible, you can press Control L or you can go to Window and make sure that the library is opened up. You're going to find your button. If you named it something, find that. Mine, I didn't name anything, and you simply drag it onto the stage. Now, when I play my movie, Look at that. There's my button. When I roll over the button, it turns red. That's my overstate. When I press down, it'll stay red, but that's it. And notice my hit area is just outside the button. So you can see that it changes right before I hit because that's my hit area. And that's how you make a button in Flash.